It does feel a little bit strange to not be playing to an audience this evening, but I guess that's the, what we have to get used to these strange times. Um, I'm sure there's a lot of people listening to us. I know there's definitely a few from Wales and Ireland. It was really nice to be here playing for you this evening. The next piece we're going to play, we're going to move from France, we're going to move to Germany 300 years into the early Romantic period. There was a famous composer, Johannes Brahms. Um, he wrote a piece based on a theme by Haydn called the St. Anthony's Chorale. It was premiered in 1907 uh, where Brahms conducted the Vienna Philharmonic himself. It's a popular tune. Uh, this is the Ayos Antonios Chorale. We shall now take you back to France, 200 years previously. There is no real story about this piece of music. It's by a famous composer at the time. His name was Lully, and it's called March to Rain. It's been used since as a French folk classic song. It's quite militarial. It's been used by Berlioz and different composers throughout time. It's very French in style. If you think about the Marseillaise, the national anthem, that similar kind of feeling. Uh, this is called March to Rain.
Now for something totally different. We're going to jump forward. We seem to be doing a lot of jumping this evening. But we're going to jump forward 250 years. Southern states of the USA, Oklahoma. And at the time, the... How can I say? There, were, there was a lot of problems amongst the black and the white uh, people there. And this is a Negro spiritual. It's called... Uh, Swing Low Sweet Chariot. It was written in about eight, 19, well, no, 1865, I think. Uh, it was about 170 years ago. Uh, this apparently is, they were singing it to Swing Low Sweet Chariot where they longed to get on the chariot and escape to another country where there, there was not slaves and they would be free. Now we move on to something, again, completely different. A piece by the Cypriot composer, Sophia, help me, the composer's name? Kostas Kakoyanis. Kostas Kakoyanis. He's written uh, a piece especially for us. Uh, it's called Prometheus. And uh, for those of you who don't know the story of Prometheus, it's a little bit brutal. I shan't get into the finer details. But basically, he stole the fire from the gods. Is that right? I need their help for this. He stole the fire from the gods, and the gods want to punish him. There are some other details, which it's too early for that at the moment. But I'm sure if you check the story, you will see. This is Prometheus.
Το επόμενο τραγούδι που θα παίξουμε με μουσική του Μάνου Χατσιδάκη και στίχου του Νίκου Κάτσου γράφτηκε για την παράσταση Λεωφορείο Ρόδο. Το χάρτινο του Φενκαράκη έχει γίνει πλέον πατσίγνωστο και πολύ αγαπημένο, όχι μόνο από παιδιά, αλλά και από ανήκη τη. Απολαύστε.
We've come to the end of our performance this evening. It's been unique, it's been very interesting, it's been great fun to play for you. It, we haven't played together for months, as you know, with the current problem, but it really has been a pleasure. Have we all enjoyed it? Yes. Great. We wish you a pleasant evening. Good night. Kalinikta.